Hi guys, this is Shivadi. In this session, I am going to explain the differences between association, aggregation and composition. Association represents the relationship between the two classes. It can be unidirectional or bidirectional. The example for the unidirectional is customer places order is the unidirectional association. Bidirectional is let us say class A is married to class B and class B is married to class A. So which is the example for the bidirectional association. Let us talk about the aggregation. In aggregation, the dependent object is standalone and can exist even if the object of the owning class is dead. Let us take an example. We have a class car and car has a dependent object as a wheel. Now when you destroy the car, the wheel object is still has its own life because this wheel can be suited for the different cars or a bike or some other way we can use the wheel. So the association between the car and wheel is the aggregation. In the UML diagram, we are going to represent the aggregation with the diamond symbol. This way we are going to represent. Let us take another example. Let us consider we have a company and an employee. These two are the two different classes. Then when you close the company, the employees are still exist because this employee can be part of the different company. So the association between the company and the employee is aggregation. Now let us talk about the composition. In the case of composition, the object of the object class that is owned by the object of its own class cannot live on its own. That means, let us take an example. We have the car and there is a specific engine which is suitable for this particular car. When you basically destroy the car, then there is no life for this specific engine which is suitable for this car. That is the reason the association between the car and the specific engine is going to be the composition. Similarly, let's talk about the another example. We have a company and there are certain accounts related to the company. So when you close the company, then there is no life to the accounts. So the association between the company and accounts is considered as composition. If we talk about the border sense, now the association is nothing but the relationship between the two classes. It can be a aggregation or the composition. In the case of aggregation, the dependent object has its own life because even though the um, the parent object are we can consider like a owning class, even though destroy, then the dependent object or the class still has its own life. In the case of composition. When the owning class is going to destroy, then automatically, automatically that, is, uh, that dependent object is also going to be destroyed. In the case of UML diagram, in order to do the, in order to represent the association, we are going to represent the arrow symbol, and in order to represent the aggregation, we have the diamond symbol, and in order to represent the composition, we are going to have the diamond symbol with the thick um, black uh, diamond symbol. So this is how basically we are going to represent uh, while um, drawing the UML diagrams for the association, aggregation and composition. So in order to understand very simple way, you can remember this one. Let us consider the simple way to remember the association and aggregation and the composition. Let us say A and B are the two classes, then A owns B, then it is called as a composition. Then that means B has no meaning or the purpose in the system without A. Then you can consider this is a composition. A uses B. That means this is called as aggregation. That is B exists independently even though A destroys. And finally the association A belongs or have B then we call as a association that means A and B exist just to have a relation. So there could be any, uh, then there ideally there not be any, uh, so class A and class B can independently exist, but there can be a, any, uh, have a some relation, then we can call as a 
association. So the better example in order to remember this concept, let us talk about a text editor. Whenever we are test, uh, we are test, uh, we are writing uh, some text. It has one buffer. That means it is called as a composition. So a test is a test editor using a file is aggre aggre aggregation because when the test editor is basically closed, then buffer is automatically destroyed. But the file itself not be destroyed. That is the reason. This is simple way you can remember the concept of association aggregation and composition. Hope you clear with the concept. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.